guys, and welcome back to Undertale. But not only that, but happy October 1st, which I cannot believe I'm saying, because it's almost Halloween, and it feels like it was just last Halloween. Like, it is actually insane. So guys, uh, later in the month, really close to Halloween, I will be doing a lot of scary videos, playing scary games, doing scary things in general. For now, we got the same old content as usual. I wanted to play some more Undertale because it's been a few days since I have, and I rem I'm really excited to get back into the game, so let's do this. I don't think I've talked to these boys yet. So last time uh, at the end, we went out to lunch with Sans. He told us about these flowers, basically, that tell people things, or like they, yeah, they tell people like lies, things like that. Somebody's messing with Papyrus, apparently. Yo, are you sneaking out to her too? Her, who? Awesome, she's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. Haha. <laughs> Who's this guy? This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Yes, that that's the thing that it was talking about. Neat, huh? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Well, what's this guy? It says that he's an echo flower. Is, are you an echo flower? They're both echo flowers? I thought this guy was a person. Okay, weird. Okay, let's keep going. We got a sign here, what does it say? This is a box. You can put an item in it or take an item out. Why would you though? You can't use items when they're in the box. <laughs> True. Sincerely, a box hater. <laughs> uh, what's in the box? Is there anything in the box? Doesn't look like we got anything in the box right now, so we're good. All right, let's go this way, I guess. There's a bridge, there's a path. Uh, I don't think I want to go this way, there's falling rocks. Unless I can avoid them? No, I can avoid them. Oh, an echo flower. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. That's what the echo flower said? Ooh. How do I... Ow! Do those hurt me? Oh, they don't. Okay, I'm fine. How do I get behind the rushing water? Uh... I don't know. That's weird. Okay, let's keep going this way. One of the echo flowers in the way. Let's go this way. Oh, we can't go down those? Oh, okay. Maybe we have to go behind the rushing water? Or can we go um, up? There's something here. Oh! Well, I did fall behind the water then. Maybe I can, like... Oh, so it, oh, so the rocks push you down when you're in the water. Oh, so you have to avoid them in the water. Okay. Makes sense. Oh, behind the rushing water upwards? Oh, oh. Oh, that's really cool. What's this? There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? Uh, I guess. I don't know why. You're carrying too much. I am? How do I, like, drop things? Do I want the tutu? What, what does the tutu do? Item. What do I not need? I don't think I need... I don't think I need a, uh, I don't think I need a stick. Let's drop that. You abandoned the stick. There's a tutu lying on the ground. Uh, yeah, I'll take it. You got the old tutu. What are these? Oh, those are the ones that you can turn on and off. Okay, cool. Well, that was just a secret, so I guess we actually got to go this way. Okay, cool. That's me. Oh, look at my shadow. Oh, that's really cool. This reminds me of the part in The Lion King when he's like running in the grass. Oh! <gasps> Is that Papyrus doing some dirty deeds? <sighs> Hi, Undyne. I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? Did I fight them? Yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? Did I capture them? W well, no. I tried very hard on Dine, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But on Dine, you don't ha have to destroy them, you see. You see. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Ooh, so she wants to kill me. Oh, <gasps> did she just see me? Oh crap. Oh freaking crap. Are we fighting? Oh, she has a spear. I don't like the spear. I don't like spears. Uh, leave me alone, Undyne. Go away, go away, go away. 
Okay, she's leaving. Do I have to move like really slowly or something? Oh, she left, okay. Whew, I thought we were about to fight her. I'm not ready for that. Oh, save point. Oh, hey, it's this little guy. He looks like Scraggy from Pokemon. Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. What did you do to get her attention? Haha, <laughs> come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. He falls on his face. <laughs> A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. Ooh, I don't like the looks of Undyne. What's this? When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Okay. Bridge seeds? So they become a bridge? So I can throw them. It looks like I'm just like balancing them on my head. Oh my god, I am. <laughs> That's so weird. So I guess we can just make a path out of them. And then they'll build a bridge? Oh, that's cool. Um, there's an actual bridge here. Oh, something's fighting me. Aeron flexes in. All right, let's fight Aeron. Phew, I'm sweating. What? What do you mean? What do you... What? Oh, you're actually sweating on me. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Dude, he's attacks you so much. It smells like a muscle farm. Oh, we have to punch him twice? Come on, in the water's fine. Come on in, the water's fine. Oh crap, oh my god, muscles, oh my god. Are you kidding me? How do I dodge those that quickly? Okay, I'm leaving, can I flee? Oh my god, Whew, that was really hard. Can I read that sign? Uh, I don't think I can, can I? Nope, oh well, it's an abandoned sign. Oh, there's bridge seeds. Do I need the bridge seeds? What is this? I'm gonna, uh, turn it down a little. If an error is made, the bell blossom can call bridge seeds back to where they started. Oh, okay. So I need to make a bridge somewhere? Where, though? Where do I need to go? Oh, up there, I think? It's gonna be here? Here? No, that'd only be three. No, 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 no. I gotta hit the bell flower. Uh, this could maybe fit four? No, that's still only three. Hmm. What about here? I think that's still just, ah, this is actually hard. Um, here? Uh, nope, that would be only three as well. Ooh, this is actually very difficult. Can we do it down here? Oh, we could, can we make a path to this? Maybe that'd give us a hint, right? Could work. Oh, put that down, hey, put that down. I think that could work, maybe. There we go. I did, okay. Congratulations, you failed the puzzle. Oh my god, this game is such a troll. This game is such a gigantic troll, dude. Okay, frick you, frick you. Um, I don't know. Where else can I even put them? What? Uh, what about this way? I mean, you can do that, but does it take you anywhere? It doesn't look like it really does anything. This is really good music, by the way. I don't know if you can hear it, but this is really good. Uh, crap. Crap in the face. What if I did, can I do them on top of each other at all? No, they have to be like straight. Okay. Okay, well, at least I know that now. Uh, is this puzzle supposed to be hard or am I just like really bad? I might just be really bad. I don't know. I haven't really seen anyone else do this puzzle. Well, I guess I have, but I don't remember. 
Um. Oh, where haven't we tried? Oh, what about, uh, would that work? This could work. This could work. Yeah, this will work. That works. There we go. Okay, that's how you do it. Okay. Okay, easy. Easy money. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequently, or sequentially until I got yours. Yeah. So, what are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a gross bandage. Is that true? Are you wearing a gross bandage? What will you say? No. So you aren't wearing a gross bandage. Got it. You're my friend, so I trust you 100%. Have a nice day. That was so weird. He's like flirting. Wishing room. It's ahead? What's the wishing room? Ooh. Washua shuffles up. I have like not a lot of HP. I'm gonna eat some uh, ice, ice cream. You're just great. You recovered 15 HP. Your soul is unclean. What are you? Are you washing my soul? Don't you wash my dang soul. Oh my god, he's like so strong. No, I have to leave, dude. I have to freaking leave. He's like so strong. What's this telescope? Look through the telescope? Sure. Found stars. Oh, I can. What is this? Check. Wall. Which wall? Doesn't seem like there's actually anything here. Okay. Which wall? What wall am I supposed to check? Here? Come on, sis, make a wish. Oh, those are what the echo flowers said. What, this? I don't know. What am I supposed to check on the wall? There's nothing to check. What are you talking about? Come on, sis, make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. What's this? Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. I don't know. I don't know what it means by check the wall. Oh, this wall? Oh, that wall. Okay. There's a bridge here. A bunch of signs. Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. The war of humans and monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. They would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows you, or allows it to persist outside the human body, even after death. Huh. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. I wonder what creature it is. Maybe it's Flowey? Maybe it's Asgore? Maybe it's Undyne? I don't know. Oh, this is a platform. Ooh, weird. Let's go. Ooh, it's shadowy again. Does that mean I'm gonna see Undyne? Oh crap, I think it does. Is that a spear? Oh my god, am I fighting her? I don't wanna fight her. I don't wanna fight her. Oh my god, leave me alone. Leave me alone, woman. Holy crap. These are like insanely easy to dodge, but still. Oh, sh oh, she brings me to like a mini game. Oh my God. No, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Ah! Frick! Are you like actually joking? How long is this damn bridge? How long is this bridge? Oh my God. She's still here? Oh. Am I hiding? Am I hiding? I think I'm hidden. Oh my god, that's like irritating. Oh my god, she's trying to find me. That's like so evil though. Jesus. She can find me? 
Oh my gosh, she found the guy! Oh, she, she found the guy who, like, loved her. She just puts him back. She found Scraggy. <laughs> can I go? I can, okay. That was really scary. Can I go this way? No, I have to go this way, I think. It, like, froze me. Oh, hi, Scraggy! I don't know what his name is. I'll just call him Scraggy. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky if you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. He falls on his face again, dude. He's so clumsy. Oh, my God. That guy's a legend. All right, let's save. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the mystical crystal, it fills you with determination. That's good, that's good. What does this say? Squeak! Oh, that's the mouse. That's awesome. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Okay. Hey, it's Sans. Hi, Sans. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally, what? 50,000 gold to use this premium telescope. But since I know you, you can use it for free. Oh, thanks. How's about it? Use the telescope? Yeah, sure, man. What does it do? It's just red. Is this like a troll? Am I finding something? I can't find anything. I think it's just red. Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, I just noticed something. There's freaking paint on my eye. Are you kidding, dude? He put paint around the lens of the telescope. So I would get freaking... <sighs> oh my god, Sans is such a troll, dude. Nothing in that box. Who's this guy? He looks like an onion. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Well, jeez. Are you a star? Yes. Oh my god. Oh, this place is bright. This, like, hurts my eyes, dude. This, like, actually freaking hurts my eyes. Hi, duck. Bye, duck. I don't know where I'm going. Uh, I can go down this way, I guess. Oh, no, there's an upwards path. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, hey, it's the hot dog. A uh, guy from earlier. It's a box for storing punch cards. It's empty right now. What's a punch card? I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Maybe because you're in a freaking cave? Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a, a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Uh... I don't think I... Actually, no, I did eat mine. 25 gold? Oh, sure, I guess. Super, here you go. Your card's in the box. You get the nice cream. Okay. I'll take it. Yep. You're carrying too much. Ah, oh, it has to be in my inventory. Well, that's fun. How do I open my inventory again? Oh, okay. Got it. Um, what do I not need? Does the tutu matter? Does anything matter? The snowman's piece I want to keep because that's kind of like a side mission. Let's just get rid of the ribbon, I guess. I don't, I don't know if it does anything. All right, let's grab the card. I'll take the card. We got a punch card. Woo! What's this say? The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> okay, well that was just a little shop, but where do I go to like progress? Oh, you can go downwards this way. Okay, cool. This music is so good. I don't know if you can hear it, but it's so good. I love it. What does this guy say? You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? No. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. Ooh, what's the wish? Which way do I go? Oh, no. Mold smalls, they're easy. I can kill them. 
Oh, you have to press it twice. Why do you have to press it twice now? Are their attacks easy? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, their attacks are pretty good. Their attacks are fine. Oh, so you can, like, do a bunch of hits. Why? Did I get a power-up or something? That's actually really cool. So you have to, like, spam A after? Oh, 55 damage. That's really good. That's, like, a really good... Whatever it is, like power up or something. Um, I want to see if I can find the rest of the conversation. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very murdery. Well, worry not, dear human. Papyrus would never betray you. You said you were not wearing a gross bandage. So, of course, I actually told her you were indeed wearing a gross bandage. It pained me to tell such a bold-faced lie. But since you aren't wearing a gross bandage, she surely won't attack you. Now you are safe and sound. Wowie, this is hard. I just want to be everybody's friend. Hmm. Okay. So, he's like kind of working with her, kind of working with me. Okay. I don't know if uh, I can trust him that much anymore. I don't know. I want to go on a date with him, though. You hear a passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. Okay, that's the next part. Okay. What's this? The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. Weird. Ooh, we got some silence. Oh, what's that? Ooh, tentacles? Is that like an octopus or a squid? Ooh, go away. What are you doing? What is it? Who is that? Whoa, my God. Whoa, what are you? You're Kawaii. Hey there, noticed you were here. I'm Onion San. Onion San, you hear? <laughs> uh, okay, Onion San. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Okay, okay. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. Uh, okay. And the aquarium's full. Uh, anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything. You hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean. You hear? Yeah, I, I hear you. No! Hey there, that's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In waterfall. Okay, bye. <laughs> that guy was so weird. That guy was so freaking weird. Oh my god. Shiren hides in the corner but somehow encounters you anyway. <laughs> Uh, let's fight. Beat him up. Yes, we got him. Oh, no, he's still alive. Uh, he doesn't know what he's doing. I don't think he's watching me. Oh, no, he hit me. Okay, cool. Beautiful. Got him. You won. All right, sweet. The northern room hides a great treasure. The northern room? A piano? There's a piano here. Play it? Sure. Oh! Uh, a... A side, down, side, up? What? Am I supposed to press all of them at the same time? How do I press all of them at the same time? Like that? I don't know. Um, is it the wrong button? I don't know what this is. I 
have no idea what that is. A haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. The first eight are fine? What does that mean? Yeah, what is... I don't get this. I don't know. I don't really understand that. Is this anything? Nope. Yeah, I don't really know what that means. Let's keep going this way. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. An incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened, and now it never will. Okay. What's this? It's a statue. The structure, the structures at its feet seem dry. Okay. What's this? Please take one. An umbrella? Oh, thanks. Take an umbrella? Sure. Can I take more? Return the umbrella? Uh, no. Okay, cool. I have an umbrella now. I don't know why I need one, but cool. Oh, because of the rain. Okay. <laughs> Nice. Oh, puddles. Look at my reflection in the puddles. That's really cool. Look at that attention to detail. Oh, hey, it's Greggy. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. <laughs> He's going to stay under it with me. Let's go. All right, follow me. Follow me, Scraggy. Don't get wet. Don't get wet, Scragster. Oh, look at his reflection in the puddle, too. I think he just wants to find Undyne. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Haha! <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Greggy. Thanks for that. Alright, let's go. Is she going to beat me up or kill me? Probably both. Ooh. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She'd beat up all the teachers. <laughs> what is wrong with this guy? I was trying to see the flower, but he interrupted me. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Okay, Scraggy, shut up now. Oh, this is the place, like, this is, like, the famous location. It's, like, on all of the kind of box art, things like that. And it's, like, so beautiful. Yeah, look at this. This is, like, the famous kind of picture. It's, like, the Disneyland castle. Scraggy's just, like, going without me. And then he's waiting for me. Uh, great. <laughs> what a freaking weirdo. This place is so beautiful. This game is just so beautiful, dude. Do you want an umbrella? Nope. Okay, bye. Uh... Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you're right. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Yo, you aren't going to be able to climb with an umbrella. Oh, put down my umbrella. Okay. Alright. Can I climb? Yay, thanks, Greggy. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. <laughs> and then he falls again. Why don't I just, like, lift him up or something? I don't know. I don't know. We got some beautiful save point here. The sound of muffled rain on the cave top. It fills you with determination. Awesome. So, guys, I think that is where we're going to end the episode for today. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're liking the Undertale series so far. And with that, see you in the next one. Bye.